guys, so today I'm going to be doing an empties video. Now, it's kind of August, but August is kind of gone, so this is just an empties video. Um, I have quite a few products, so I'm just going to start. And the first one, I'm just containing them, by the way, in this little box that Sarah gave me, which you know I love. Um, so the first thing is the Simple Kind Skin Soothing Facial Toner. I was about to say cleanser then. Um, I've had this for ages and I just, I really did like it, um, as you can see, all gone. Um, I really liked it because, um, I felt like it added some moisture, um, to my face because I have quite dry skin and then also putting moisture, moisturiser on top of it, it just, I found it worked really well and it helped remove any excess makeup that my cleanser didn't remove. So yeah, it's really cheap, really simple and really good. Simple ha. Huh? Um then I've used up a Boots Essentials nail polish remover. Um I just picked up any random nail nail polish remover and used it up. Not really much I can say about it. It's nail polish remover, it didn't do anything amazing, but it didn't do anything awful. So yeah. And then the next thing got some pots, I'll show those last. Next thing is the Tea Tree and Witch Hazel Foam Face Wash. I use this absolutely loads, as you can see, it's all gone. That last little bit is just the bottom, the water where I've washed it out. Um, I, w I go through these not as quickly as I think I do. I think I go through them really quickly, but I actually don't. I don't know when, I can probably check on one of my last hauls when I last bought one of these, but I've actually stopped using this now, not because it broke me out, not because of any reason in particular, other than um, it in the winter my skin gets super, super dry. And in the summer this is alright because um, it is quite drying for the skin, but then I put moisturiser on top. But in the winter I do not like using anything that's drying for my skin, as soon as it gets really, really dry on its own. So yeah, I use that up and I haven't repurchased that. Oh, and I also haven't repurchased the Simple Toner because I'm going to try out a different toner. And Nail Polish Remover, obviously I've repurchased it, but I've repurchased the little, the little Bourjois Pot, um, which is really, really good by the way. So, moving on to like, packety sachet things. This is the Boot Simply Sensitive Anti-Redness Serum. I love this. I bought this because I was going through a stage where my skin was really, really red. Um, and I just wanted something quick and easy and something that I could just put on that was light but would help cool down my skin and this does exactly that. It's got um, soothing aloe vera in it, whether that helps or not I don't know but it certainly helps on my skin. It doesn't like, I don't know how it does it and it doesn't feel like it's doing anything but if you sort of go away and then look it back in the mirror again you're like wow I really have calmed down. Um, and I have actually repurchased one of these because I love it and I don't think I'll ever be able to be without it now. And then the next packety sachet thing is the Blistex Intensive Moisturiser. Now, ages ago I finished my dad's relief my Blistex my dad's Blistex relief cream for some reason and used it every single night and loved it. Then when I went into my boots um, that's local to me, they didn't have it, so I got this instead. And I'm literally, I'm probably get two more uses out of this, um, but I thought I'd include it because it's basically empty. Um, I, I don't love this as much as the relief cream. The relief cream is much more thicker, and this was kind of a bit more liquidy. Um, and I just feel like the relief cream will be better for the winter again, just because I get really dry lips and dry skin, etc. So yeah, I have enjoyed using this, but I've repurchased a different version. And then I have three pots. Two are from Soap and Glory and one is just from Superdrug. So I'll start with the Superdrug one. Um, my best friend Ella got this, me, got me this, yeah, that's the one. Got me this um, for my birthday last year when I was 15. God, that sounds like that, well, ages ago. Um, and it's the Coconut and Sheer Butter Body Butter. And as you can see, used it all up. I really liked this. The smell, uh, if you don't like coconuts, you will not like this. But I don't mind coconuts, so I quite liked this. This is just a 50ml jar. 
Um, I just used this on my legs and it did make my legs nice and smooth but I've kind of accumulated body butters over since then so I haven't repurchased this one but I really did enjoy using it when I had it. And then I have my two Soap and Glory ones. This one the um, packaging has come off. This is Soap and Glory Flake Away. You can't actually see because the label on the side came off. I have repurchased this because I love it. I don't know, I was going to say I don't know whether you can smell that, of course you can't. Um, I don't know whether you can see that I've used it all up, but I'll, I'm doing close up things. Um, but yeah, I really like this. It says, apply onto damp skin and massage in circular motions until most of the grains are gone. Rinse well. Um, I use this when I'm shaving my legs, or before I shave my legs. Um, just because it, I find it gets any dead skin cells away so that you get a closer shave and it makes your legs so smooth, so silky. Um, so yeah, I have repurchased this. I repurchased the same size, not the big size, just because I didn't really want to be lugging that big thing about if I go like to my grandparents or anywhere. The big one is really big and I don't actually go through these too quickly so I thought I'd just get a small one again. And then this is the Soap and Glory Righteous Butter. Again, this is one of the body butters that I accumulated over like the past couple of years or the past year. And this is smooth onto damp skin, massage until all sinks in. So yeah, I really liked this as well. It's kind of like the signature Soap and Glory scent. Um, and it says with softening, sheer butter and aloe vera. I did like this, but... I didn't repurchase it just because, like I said, I've got loads of body butters, but body butters at the moment, so I don't really need any more. So that's the end of my empties video. I thought I'd film an empties video just because I've been seeing them around quite a lot, and I really enjoy watching them just because, like, you often see people buying things like hauls, but you don't often see people using up things like the empty things. And I just think it's really nice, oops I just kicked my tripod, I think it's really nice just to show like, look I actually use things up. So yeah, I'll probably not be doing one of these for a while now just because I don't tend to go through products that, that much. But you know when you just have one of those months where everything just comes and ends and finishes all your products, so that was just one of those months. So I hope you all have a lovely day and I'll see you all again soon. Bye! I like this and I'm going to carry on using it and I may do a tutorial using it at some point soon, maybe, if you want to, if you want me to.